Now you come over here. I'm sure you taste much better when you're afraid. <laughs> hello everyone welcome back to my channel welcome if you are new in today's video i am at home depot and sorry there is no audio for this particular animatronic and sorry at the beginning if it was loud but there were other people playing other animatronics so without further ado let's get into this video so as i mentioned he has no audio i don't know why they don't have any audio with this guy. He was very, very cool. And he does take sips of his drinks. But I thought he was really neat. I wish I could have heard what he actually did. They say this cemetery is haunted. Most of the time, those buried here stay dead. But every once in a while, one pops up and grabs them. <laughs> so be careful where you dig now. If you're not, they're liable to snatch your ankle and pull you right in with them. <laughs> you sure look fresh and clean. You've never had to claw your way out of the earth before, have you? Ever wonder what it's like to be buried alive? Well, maybe tonight will be your lucky night then. <laughs> Some folks get superstitious about digging up the dead. Well, I can't blame them. The things I've seen would make your skin crawl. Similar to these juicy worms I just found. See, this job ain't all bad. These worms will make a tasty snack for later. <laughs> I love this witch. I love how there is an eyeball in her hand and it lights up. It is very cute. I will show more of this footage towards the end so you can see her a little bit more. Can you hear the bubbling noise? That is the cauldron, and it is sold separately from the witch. The witching hour is here. And there is nothing to be afraid of, except for me. <laughs> now you come over here. I'm sure you taste much <laughs> let me know in the comments down below what your favorite animatronic is i love how this dog's eyes light up as well Light. 
I swear this Home Depot was the noisiest and loudest location ever between the tractor making the beeping noise and other customers pressing the buttons on the animatronics and then employees. There was about a group of five of them that were um, pressing the buttons as well and they were watching me record. I almost felt like they were doing it to me on purpose at one point. This is the same setup they had last year with all the different style skeletons and they have a bunch of that bat skeleton that went viral if you guys are looking for it now's the time to get him um they have a bunch of him and they had other styles that were new as well again they had a huge selection and i love how all their eyes light up they just had a great selection. You'll see in some of my footage, I pan over so you can see that I wasn't just saying it. There was a bunch of employees around where I was and they were pushing the buttons. So again, I do the best I can, you guys. I'm not going to talk about each item that I'm showing you here. I'm just going to do a little disclaimer that I was showing these products over here on the shelving just because there were so many people around the front where the animatronics were and just the beeping of the tractor thing that they use around the store. So I was hoping that things were going to quiet down when I was done filming and giving you an overview back here. Not everything was working and some of the things that I wanted to test for you guys was high up like all of these um, animatronics that I couldn't really reach. So I do the best I can and I will go back to the front towards the end of this video.
Can you imagine putting this type of rabbit in your front yard for Easter? Oh my gosh, the neighbors would be talking. <laughs> I can only imagine what they would be thinking if you put that Easter bunny in the front of your house for Easter. So I'm kind of on the fence. I think that as far as decor and decor that I like, I feel like Lowe's and Home Depot are kind of in sync with each other. I like stuff that both of the locations have to offer. I think both stores have really great animatronics. So um, what are your thoughts about what Lowe's and Home Depot has for this season? I did noticed that a few of these items were brought back from last year but they have a lot of really great stuff so i'm excited for both stores and if you like wool molds and the pumpkins that light up they had a very good selection to choose from um you would not be disappointed so i especially like their tall stacked pumpkins that light up those are great i really like those a lot um but yeah they had some great items They had a really great selection of different tombstones if you're doing a spooky cemetery in your yard for Halloween. They had some really good ones and I really like them. They were really unique and good quality. You're going to see a lot of footage of me filming this headless horseman because this is where all the employees are standing when I'm trying to record. You can hear people talking in the background and etc. my 
my duty to rid the world of it. Bring me your wounded. I guess I really didn't show the employees as much as I thought I did, but it's also a privacy thing too. I don't want to show them in my video, but you could hear them pounding and talking. They were just being super loud and they knew I was recording. This tree is cool, but it doesn't talk. It just changes colors. So I thought for how cool it is, they should have made it talk or move its arms or something. I just thought that it was kind of blah, but it's still really neat. Do you hear me guys? That's the employees and literally the second I was done filming and we started to like leave, they all walked away. I love these stack pumpkins. They are so cool looking and they would be so neat in front of your house, especially if you had a set of two of them, like one on each side of like your walkway, or if you're doing a creepy cemetery, I just think that they are so very cool, as well as these skull head ones are cool too. I'm just going back over everything and giving a second overview because again, I wanna make sure that I show everything and I want you guys to be able to get a good look and look at the dog's eyes, how it lights up. Be 
Well, thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. I hope everyone enjoyed this video. Comment down below what you, was your favorite item. And please make sure to hit that like and subscribe button as it really helps my channel out a lot. And I appreciate it so very much. So until the next one, happy haunting.